Hello my soccer universe to the final part of this season's Bundesliga jersey review. We have again only four teams in there. I'm wearing one of these, Frankfurt. I was in, in between one of the two surprise teams. I decided I like Frankfurt better than Wolfsburg, although Mainz could have also been worn. I had the option, but then I said, okay, let's wear my favorite among these. And this is, of course, Frankfurt with Wolfsburg already being a seeded team and most likely featured in the thumbnail for this video, or will be featured in the thumbnail of this video. Of course, you've already seen it. I don't even know how it looks like at this moment. This is the weird stuff about your YouTube. So be it. In any case, uh, how did I choose the, the teams in this video? I did it like of all my other review videos this season and last season so far. I went through last season standings, went to 1, 2, 3, 4, 4, 3, 2, 1. Every team with a 4 next to it has is featured in this video. And then I ordered them how I call them alphabetically. So we have Augsburg, Frankfurt, Mainz and Wolfsburg in that order. We also see a jersey that we have, I think, ever since I'm doing the reviews, <laughs> I've seen this jersey. Maybe, maybe now that that is right. But this is now uh, there's a jersey in there that's used for th at least a third season in, in in a row, which is kind of amazing in a way. Uh, but we'll save that one for a little bit later. We'll start in Augsburg. Augsburg uses a home jersey that I should love a whole lot, but for the colors, no, the colors just don't work. This is a Nike template we already saw with Sturm Graz, um, and I think it's a really good template for a striped jersey. I would love if Milan could use, for instance, something like that. Uh, or uh, even Inter should have used it this season, uh, so, something like that. Any other striped team with Nike should use this template. I really like the template. However, Red with darkish green is jarring. This is something, ah, it just doesn't go. Uh, and as much as I would love this shirt, it, it, it is ugly. It is downright ugly. Uh, if you have red and green, you should use one as the main color and the other was an accent. And that works really, really, really well. But if you have those very contrasting colors competing for each other's attention, it just makes a whole lot of ugly jersey and just by uh, as i told you there's many things to like here and it's more adventurous than we had last, last, last season but just the choice of colors is odd and i have to give this three stars if not even if I, and i'm being lenient here i really wonder why augsburg isn't going for the classic look with a white jersey with one uh, red and green side stripe that I don't get. Uh, we have at least the away jersey in white and at least we get all, 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 all the colors. This is a very well done away jerseys in all the accents. We have the crest, we have the um, uh, swoosh in red, we have the sponsor in green. So we have all these colors in there. Now the template, yeah, this is the Croatia away jersey, a little bit taken uh, to white with gray doesn't look necessarily bad but it's also not exactly my favorite but i have to say this works for me better than the home jersey in many 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 ways uh, i'm gonna give this six stars and then they have a third jersey and i wonder why black i mean I, black and you know take suck all the life out, out, out of it and then the gray shoulders here you know augsburg the classic would be you have one in white, you have one in red, you have one in green with the same uh, template kind of and you uh, switch switch it up. Don't go with this blackish uh, thing if you don't have a blackout shirt or you know uh, the crest. I mean this tree that's in the, in the middle you'll, you'll, you'll don't even see. Four stars. I'm sorry. I'm always harsh on Aug Augsburg in many, many, many ways. Um, although, if they would use the Claire Classic, that's a really nice jersey. And I remember one uh, 1819 I liked with the green shoulders. It was also nice. You could use this template for that. They don't do it, unfortunately. Um, another one where I have a big uh, bone to pick is Frankfurt. This is for me a Frankfurt jersey. Uh, just black, even though it is a nice template with a red accent, but just black doesn't do it for me for Frankfurt. I'm sorry. For me, Frankfurt, when I grew up, Frankfurt was always red and black. I was even uh, fine with the black and white, uh, which is kind of the traditional uh, look. But I think Frankfurt jerseys either look best red and black stripes or 
take red as a main color or white as a main main color and add a few accents of the other but um i don't like black and i know this is a look they have been going for because they've been successful in europe with it i just don't like it um i love that the i mean the template itself the shirt itself is really nice and as a third jer jersey i i would love it i just don't love it as a home jersey frankly uh frankly for frankfurt yeah that sounds good and so yeah uh, it's again the color choice that puts it down for me um is it a bad jersey no um it's actually a pretty nice jersey maybe just not frankfurt and so i'm caught yeah i'm gonna go six here but i you know if it was it could be better i actually do like the away jersey this is a frankfurt home jersey i like this one a whole lot um it has even you know this one had this uh pixelated graphic uh, upside down which is of course the frankfurt römer uh this one has something similar um, on the side uh, it's not exactly li li lucky, but there's a certain kinship between this shirt and this uh, shirt that, that you see in the video. Uh, I like I liked that it does something different. I, I do like this one a whole lot, especially for Frankfurt. This screams Frankfurt to me. Um, I'm gonna go eight stars here. Call me crazy. I'm gonna go eight stars with this one. And we're out of Frankfurt, unfortunately, uh, but I'm sure there will be another one. But we'll move only a little bit further west to the main rival, Mainz. Um, and you see the Mainz jersey from last season, now they kind of said, okay, we have this really nice new pattern, which I think is carnival inspired, not 100%, but we had it on the sleeves, where I actually thought, 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 thought it's really fun. Now we're gonna go the other way around, we saw what Köln was doing with the carnival jersey, we put the pattern all over the torso and we have red sleeves. It's basically a reversal of last season's uh, home shirt, and looks a little bit Croatia. Uh, I'm of two minds. I really like to make it bold and you have something very unique there. So love that one. But I love the pattern as an accent more than as a main color. I also don't like that the back of this jersey is just red. I mean, I saw them yesterday play in Dortmund in this shirt and the front looks awesome with the great, the great pattern and on the back. Yeah. Um, also, now this is very nitpicky. Uh, you have this sponsor that's three line and kind of a little a little bit busy, but the logo in blue. Either get rid of it or cut out and make it white here. I know this is a, is a little bit contentious, but I think this, this, this will make, make it uh, look better. I have to say, overall, the Kappa template, really nice. There's not, not much to complain. It's just, is this pattern too much or not? I honestly think it goes maybe a teeny step too far, but it's still a very strong look looking shirt. Um, so I'm, yeah. Ideally a plain red with the pattern on the sleeves. That, that, that would be a 9 to 10. I'm going to give this a 7, but it's a shirt. I have been can't, 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 can't playing one, but I, then I said I'm going to go for this one because this was the original in, in a way, but it's a really nice shirt. Um, the away shirt um, looks kind of boring in comparison, and it is... Uh, Spoilers, well, I'm not gonna go high here. However, there's this pattern in there, which is of course of the coat of arms from mine. So I do like this reference there. Uh, it doesn't make for a much better shirt. I'm gonna go five here. Gray in, in, in addition will never sit well with me. And then we have the third jer jersey in black and gold. And again, I could cry foul. No, again, black and gold with gray. However, you take the pattern that we already have present here. Although, yeah, exactly this one is present on the red shirt here so you have the pattern and then gold makes sense for mines because uh mines has this kind of um the golden city in latin is kind of golden mines so uh there is some connection that makes it all right for me i think it's also a pretty nice nice shirt um six stars and see how the sponsor can be nice if it's just all in gold so mines really well done and then we're at the last team which was last season's surprise team in wolfsburg um, I this one here is crazy. I need to get the fingers right. This, this this one is crazy. They decided we'll remain with the really bright green. However, I don't know what this graphic pattern. They got rid of the X, which I actually liked. Was so much Wolfsburg. Now there is a very abstract pattern in there. I would love it if this had any relationship with the city of Wolfsburg. I don't think it has. 
Um, however, I like that they went for, yeah, we go bright green all out. Uh, again, weird color from the Nike template, but um, yeah. It's not the uh, you know it's not uh, the standard shirt of the season. For some reason, um, I did like last season a little a little bit better, although it has a lighter shade because it is mixes green with white. Here is a light green with a darker green, and then you have white accents. Um, it's real, but it also it, the, let's go six stars uh, to go out there um and then they have a dark green away jersey again looks very nice i like the wolf on the inside uh this one i do like a whole lot but i, I like last season's black jersey a little bit better but this one is another uh, winner i like this dark green with the light green that makes it real then the crest pops although here maybe you could have gone take the white out yeah take the white out uh leave the star dark green just have the outline out there and i think it would look even better so uh yeah a few points deduction but it's a very very strong looking shirt eight stars and now we come to the one i think third season in a row for this one has the city code code of arms in there this was 1920 first in introduced it makes sense as a third jersey they need it doesn't look bad i've talked about it a whole lot six stars we are done with the bundesliga uh, jersey review I don't know yet which one I will go next, whether it will be Bundesliga or it will be, uh, no, the Bundesliga, <laughs> La Liga or the Premier League. Maybe I should pull a poll up on YouTube and let you decide which one I will do next. In any case, give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video, subscribe to my channel if you want to see more. Let me know where you agree and where you disagree, which churches do you like in there and I will talk to you soon. Bye! Hey there, I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, here are some videos and playlists that you actually might enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel and hit that little bell icon so that you get updated whenever something happens in my soccer universe. And with that, have a wonderful day!